Hey guys, Reaper here, and I'm bringing you a brand new Hot or Not video. But, before we get started on that, I bet you're wondering about this shirt I'm wearing. Well, this shirt is the brand new Fiery Feast shirt. The design on the front is all my own, made it myself, colored it myself. On the back... We have our Keep Life Spicy slogan. I do plan on having these as merchandise. Um, the back may have to change. That may have to move to the front so I can get the cost down. But the design on the front is as it is. It's going to stay that way. No worries there. So it may look a little bit different, but it's still going to be the shirt. Everybody loves it already. They're excited for it. They already want it. We're good to go on that part. So, <coughs> today, we're going to be taking a look at the Snyder's Jalapeno Pretzel Bites and whether they are hot or not. You know them. You've seen them. You probably had them. You love them. Maybe. I don't know. But I have already opened them, so you don't have to hear all that crinkling, whatever. And we're going to try this out. So, we are going to see if they are truly are hot or not. But, before we do that, I do have two things. First, if you haven't and are brand new, you should head to Facebook. Check out the Facebook group, Fiery Feast. That's all it is. That's simple. It's a group created by me of where I upload. When my videos load, I do polls on there, questions on there. All my upload, that's my main source of uploading. And if for some reason YouTube doesn't want, isn't working correctly, once you're a part of that, you'll always have information on the videos, when they're coming out, when I uploaded. So it's really important to be connected to that, especially as a backup. So just want to toss that out there. Join really great. We've already got almost 60 members already within just a couple weeks. Super excited. Great to have that going. Hope we can keep it going and build that community and that family and have the fiery feast flame keep soaring higher. <clears throat> so as I was saying, the Snyder's Pretzel Bites. Are they hot or not? Well, do I think they're going to be hot? No, I don't think they are. I think there may be just a touch of heat in there from them using actual jalapenos, possibly seeds. I'm not sure how they do it. But I think the ratio of pretzels to jalapenos is going to make it that you may taste a little bit of heat, but it's not going to be overwhelming. It's not going to overpower you. It's not going to be like eating a real jalapeno, fresh, picked out of the garden, you know, just as fresh as you could possibly get it. So that that's my, my conjecture on it. I do not think these are going to be hot. I don't think they're going to be like, woo, I got to have this, this, up here, this, well, what's the word I'm looking for? This quench for the heat. Now, so, I think it's going to be a snack. You're going to be like, oh, there's a little bit of heat there. Whatever. But enough of that. Let's get to the real part. Let's get to trying these pretzel bites. Whereas we're always going to do it the same that we do before. We're going to try a piece, see how that is on its own. Some people eat it piece by piece. Some people eat a couple, so we're going to try it both ways. Not too bad. So, now we're going to try a couple pieces. What if you like to eat it, you know, a couple pieces at a time? So now we're just going to take maybe two or three. 
I'm going to take two. The pipes are loud. Again, a little bit of heat, but nothing too bad. Although they may have changed the recipe because these don't, these taste like they have a little bit more than usual. So it's possible it was a heavier batch that they added more, that they got feedback that there wasn't enough in it possible but still not knock your socks off not big deal if you've had a jalapeno or a habanero before this is nothing for you now we're gonna try a couple pieces not a lot So, <clears throat> yeah, pretty much what I figured. I'm not going to increase the amount of that, otherwise you're going to risk choking. Uh, it's just going to be too many, it's going to be way too noisy, and there's, stuff's going to fall. You know, so, what do I think? How do I think it held up? compared to what I thought going into this. Well, I think I was dead on. You, you can taste some of the heat. Like I said, they may have added more to make it a little bit spicier. But again, if you're used to jalapenos, habaneros, ghost peppers, this isn't going to be anything for you. It's not going to knock your socks off. You know, you may have some of that heat to it. You may feel it a little bit, but it's going to be a walk in the park to you. Um, you know, some people are a little more sensitive, so it may be hotter for them. There's always, always that. Some people, it's not going to be hot. Some, it is going to be hot. To each their own. But to average people who've had jalapenos before, this is nothing. And I think wholeheartedly, hands down, anybody who's had them, who knows how they are, can agree with me that these are a not. So, Having that said, I do want you guys to, if you enjoyed this video, hit the like button. Don't forget to hit that bell icon to be notified of when I upload. If you enjoyed this video and you like what I do here, then feel free to share the video. Help fuel that flame a little more. Help spread it. Get people interested. Don't forget to head to Facebook to check out the Fiery Feast Facebook group. So that way, should we have any issues here where notifications aren't sent or whatever, any technical issues, you'll be notified and updated on there of when I upload and when the videos get put up. And then you can join a great family, a great community, and if you have any facts or information about chili peppers or you want to you know send you know uh an item i should try that's what i'm looking for wow i can't speak <laughs> an item i should try you can head it up there you know put it out there if you have facts about it hey did you know this about chili peppers boom perfect place for it um and i think that's about it for you this video Subscribe to Fuel the Fire. The channel disclaimer is going to be up here. Haven't seen it. I urge you to see it. Super important about my videos. And the videos over here are going to be the previous video and recommended video. And as always, guys, 
we need to start this the way we ended it. As always, I want to say, keep life spicy. I'll see you next time.